Hi, this is Robert with American Prepper XJ. I want to talk a little bit about solar panels, but first, please subscribe, like, if you like this channel. Uh, solar panels is a good energy source. They're low maintenance, honestly. All you have to do is clean the dirt and debris off the panels, you know, every few months. Uh, it's always good to have them for emergencies like, you know, storms and, you know, outages. Uh, you should always have multiple energy sources though, uh, like uh, solar panels, wood turbine, or a generator, in this case the power goes out. For everyday household living, you know, uh, I currently have a 200 watt system going on. I'm going to go to a 1000 watt system to power most of my appliances in my household. Uh, this is what I've done so far. Uh, I ran 8 gauge multi strand wire from my panels to my garage over that way. Uh, I ran 4 positive wires to my garage before I can hook up multiple systems. You know, because uh, if I want to go bigger than a 1000 watt system, I have the option to do it. I already ran the wires for it. Uh, we live in America. America is a beautiful country. You know, just look around. You know, you can't get any better than that. Uh, <coughs> but you never know what's going to happen. Alright? Any natural disaster can cause chaos or whatnot. You know, just be prepared, you know, stock some food, you know, uh, make sure you have uh, water on hand for any natural disaster. Like, I live in Michigan, you know, we get snowstorms and blizzards and, you know, everything else. You know, we lose power, you know, here and there, you know, sometimes, you know, a week or two at a time. But, you know, that's, that's just how we live. Uh, so it's always good to have, you know, water on hand and food, you know, if you can't, if you can't get out. But, uh, but yeah, this is my uh, solar system here. I'll take you into the garage and show you my setup I got going on. Uh, I have a grid tie inverter going on for just put the power back in the power grid. I currently don't have a battery bank yet. Uh, to, to, go to, to get a proper battery bank, you should get golf cart batteries. They last like 15 years with proper maintenance. Uh, I have, uh, you know, uh, a setup for, you know, I, I got I got a power inverter, you know, two to four watts, so I can power most of my appliances. You know, I got a grid tie inverter. And I have a reader, a readout meter, to show how much power I put back in the power system. I currently put in 100, 180 watts of power because uh, it takes a little bit of energy. I lose, I lose power as I get to the garage, but it's going a longer distance, so it's typical. Uh, but please subscribe, though. Please subscribe and like if you like this channel. There'll be more videos coming soon. Thank you. Bye.